So what is a generic? At this point in time, we've learned how to type basic functions in TypeScript. Here, we have our function create list, which takes a parameter of item, which is a type number, and returns an array of numbers. And finally, inside of the function, we go ahead and define a constant that is an array of numbers where we push that new item on and then return the said list. With this function, you get type safety, but it's rather limiting, isn't it? If we were to name this function properly, we'd probably want to call it something like create number list. But then this wouldn't be really reusable. So the question is, how do we make this reusable? Hmm. In TypeScript, this is solved with the concept of generics. At a high level, generics allow you to define a dynamic type that will be used in the function. The way you can tell that generics are being used is when the function name is appended with the greater than and less than symbols. This then allows you to pass in a type rather than a JavaScript value that is typically passed in the parentheses instead. Knowing this, we can now swap out our number type for this new dynamic custom type, which we can pull in when the user invokes our function. And so for the constant number list, we can now pass in the type number, and we'll go ahead and apply it into our create list function. And similarly, if we wanted to create a list of strings, we could then pass in string inside of the brackets, and then the create list function will take care of the rest. Before we move on though, I want you to know that it's actually a convention within the TypeScript community to refer to our generic parameters using single letters, and it typically starts with the letter T. And while personally I prefer to be a little bit more explicit with my variable names, this is a convention that is used in the community, so I don't want you to be thrown off when you see it.